Are you thinking about taking a break from social media and going on a social media detox? I'm Colin McGraw and I'm gonna tell you guys the story of why I decided to get rid of social media for the past month here um, and why it's been so great for me. And the short answer is yes, you should 100% delete social media for a month. And I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna give you the three reasons I decided to get rid of it and I'll tell you the results and why it's been such a great month for me. So let's go for a little walk and I'll tell you guys my story. Come on. Guys, I'll say the primary reason, the number one reason I deleted social media is uh, a girl was in my head. <laughs> girl was in my head, she was really messing with it. I was doing things very out of characteristic. Um, lost my calling confidence. Essentially, I just lost control. If you feel yourself losing control. Oh, Tana, relax. I'm not gonna lose. I was just like posting stories, hoping she'd see them. Uh, I was looking at her stories. I was just overthinking things. And I was like, oh, I just gotta get off of this, take a little break, get a little bit of a breather. Time heals all with girls. So if you can get off of social media, take a little break from seeing your crush or someone you have feelings for, whatever it might be, it helps. <laughs> it definitely helps. And then number two, um, it was just such a waste of time. I was just like constantly on my phone, just scrolling, scrolling. And then after like an hour of that, I just don't remember anything. And I bet a lot of you guys can relate to that. <laughs> what am I doing with my life? I'm alive! I'm alive! Free yourself! <laughs> <laughs> and then number three was... Wow, I was just like really depressed after watching a bunch of it. I was like, this is really bumming me out. Um, combination of one, when on Instagram, I was just constantly seeing like single guy stuff, like reels, um, always couples posting pictures. And as a single guy, I was like, oh, I can't take this. I need a break. Like, this is awful. <laughs> and like on Twitter, for some reason, my logarithm was just showing me like fight videos, like horrendous fight videos, just really awful stuff. And I don't know why, I always follow just like sports people on Twitter, but when did Twitter get to be a point where it's like, no one you follow is what you're seeing anymore. It's all stuff that just the logarithm's throwing at you. But look, those are my reasons that I deleted social media. Um, let me tell you guys the results and what I experienced. I would say the first thing I noticed as soon as I deleted social media was that I was constantly picking up my phone I would scroll on it for two seconds. I'm like, what am I doing on my phone? Put it down. Five, 10 minutes later, pick up the phone again. What am I doing on this? Put it down again. I was like Dwight with the Altoids. I was constantly cut like a bell. Like I was like a dog. Just like kept coming back to it. Altoid? Sure. Vintoid? Vintoid? Yes. So I was like, that was the first thing I noticed. But now a month later, I'm not doing that habit anymore. It's kind of like I've weaned myself off the addiction. Hey guys, if you're enjoying this video so far, go, make sure you go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe. All right, let's keep going with the video. <laughs> oh yeah, I also noticed my screen time definitely decreased. Um, but you know what I would say? It didn't de decrease as much as I thought. What I was really doing instead was I was watching like YouTube videos or like listening to podcasts while playing games on my phone at the same time. So I don't know if that's a, actually, I, I just, it is much better. It's much better just cause it's like, I'm not, you know, mindless content that I can't remember. I'm remembering this stuff and I'm actually gaining information. I was watching a bunch of financial podcasts and YouTube videos. So I really, really liked that. Definitely, definitely feel less bummed out. Um, it's just like a nice cleanse, just being off of social media. Uh, you just kind of clear your head. You focus on yourself a little bit more. As cliche as that sounds, you get to do some projects. So I just, I don't know, I just went to the gym more, focused on some personal projects. Did a lot more reading um, than I have in the past. So I really enjoyed that. So it almost like resets you and gets you back to basics. Um, I will say another thing though, is you do feel a little bit left out. Like I definitely felt like my friends or coworkers were talking about things that went viral or thing that have been people have been seeing you do feel really behind on that a little bit of an outsider <laughs> oh did anybody see that that documentary on the korean war oh, oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, the 
It's such a beautiful country. With such a sad history. Yeah. I will say though that I will be downloading social media again. Um, I don't know when. Um, I'm enjoying being off of it, but you do feel a little bit left out. I will say that. All right, that's it, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Now get off your phone. <laughs> but subscribe first. All right, guys. See you guys next time. <laughs>